What's going on guys? Welcome to today's vlog. Sorry for the loudness, but I'm gonna take you guys through what I did today for my chest routine in the gym. I just finished up. It was a quick 55 to an hour 15 with a little bit of uh, cardio at the end. So let's jump right into this vlog. And by the way, this chest workout is for mass on your chest. Let's get it started. <laughs> So for the first exercise, I completed a Smith Machine Incline um, chest press, as you guys can see right here. And on this one here, guys, you really wanna keep that back arched. Uh, you wanna have your elbows turned in, whatever feels more comfortable for you. Sorry for the sky train. But as I say, guys, so back arched, keep your butt on the bench, keep your shoulder blades back, and you kinda wanna shrug up, bring your back, bring your shoulder blades back and then push up with your chest guys make sure your chest is fully engaged I did about three to four sets here um, anywhere from 10 to 15 reps always starting out with two warm-up sets and then went on to about three to four working sets I think I went up to about a plate 25 a plate 35 and then I think I did a drop set right at the very end as you guys can see and that's all guys so the for the first one you want to get the most out of your workout I like starting with an incline everyone looks better with a nice upper chest you can tell just by looking at someone if they got a v-neck or a scoop neck on they have a very developed upper chest then they probably have a very good chest in general the second exercise guys that we went on to was just the flat dumbbell bench press I like incorporating this every so often as I say guys at the beginning of this vlog this is more for mass putting some inches on your chest uh, not too many flies, which we will go into later, but the second one, as I mentioned, guys, was the dumbbell flat bench press. And as you guys can see here, go as heavy as you can. I couldn't go as heavy today. I was feeling a little bit weak. I did 60, 70, 80 pound dumbbells. Um, same thing as the other one, guys, back arched. But go do the, the range of motion how you feel. Some people like to have it up here. Some people like to have it down here. Whatever feels more natural for you guys, but always engage that chest. You don't want your shoulders to come into play. Pick a weight that you're comfortable. You can do anywhere from eight to 12 reps, but still engaging that chest. You do not want to have some sore shoulders after that. So I like this one as a second one. On my bench days, I'll probably do bench roughly around two times a week but I will switch it up and do the dumbbell one as you guys can see here. The third exercise guys, we incorporated some cable flies as you guys can see. Now for this one here, I started off by just doing, putting them at the top and going down kind of um, like this kind of motion. But as I went on throughout the workout, I then did it a little more up here, engage that upper chest a little bit more. This one guys, I like keeping my feet together one in front of the other is fine with you but as I said whatever feels more comfortable and natural for you guys and just always always control the weight on this one especially because it's a cable you need to control the weight and use your chest I cannot strain the importance on that so I went anywhere from 40s 50s and 60s on the cables and really engaging that chest you can bring up the cables lower up or wherever you guys want to do it but whatever's more comfortable for you guys. The next exercise we went on to was gonna be a superset. So as you guys can see here, I'm starting out with, these are a little bit different cable flies. I kind of call these ones the Y because as you guys can see, I'm starting here and I'm bringing them up like a Y shape. So try this one out. It may not work for you guys, but I really like it to engage that upper chest as well. So up here, come together, up here. You wanna kind of, Control the weight, but pick a grip that is more natural for you guys and you can feel it on here Sometimes I like it like this. Sometimes I like it like that Whatever feels better for you guys and then I supersetted that exercise with just the close uh, Push I don't know. I don't know how to explain that but just pushing that weight keeping the same weight as I did I believe I did 30s and just keep pushing it right there guys the first exercise of it 10 to 12 reps the second one I was burnt out, so I did anywhere from eight to 10 reps. The last and final exercise that I completed for the chest were the dips. This one's kind of self-explanatory. However, you guys think of dips, you guys think of triceps. If you want to engage that chest and take the triceps out of play, as you guys can see right here, 
pop up on the dip bars, put your knees and your feet backwards, push that chest forward, and then bring your knees back. So you're leaning forward a lot, engaging that chest, and I did anywhere from eight to 10 reps, and I believe I did three to four sets as well. Those guys, lots of content to come. I'm uploading anywhere from two to three videos a week where I try to at least hit that subscribe button. This channel is going to blow up. I'm dedicating what I can through the summer, through this channel. I take this as a hobby, not a job. So I love everything that I do and I wanna share with you guys, motivate you guys, inspire you guys to just set any goal and achieve that goal. So I'm here to help you guys hit that subscribe button. I will catch you guys in the next one.